I'm Rob. Welcome to Build Up, the show about shows between the shows. Jessica Keenan Wynn is here to talk about Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again, where she plays young Tanya. Yeah, and Jessica is no stranger to musicals, having played Cynthia in Beautiful, the Carol King musical, and she also played one of the Heathers in Heathers, the musical, which is a personal favorite of mine. I actually saw it. Woo! Hey, everyone. Hey, How's everyone audience? doing here? Get hyped! Yeah! Woo! You guys excited? Yeah. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. Well, we all have uh, some secrets about pop culture. We thought we could uh, create a little safe space here in the studio yeah. where we could share some of our, you know, personal confessions yeah, some... about music, about musicals, about our experience, and basically our life having to do with mm -hmm. music. And we call that segment Couch Confessions. Couch Confessions. Couch confessions. Well, whenever my family would have company over, I'd always make them watch me do my Michael Jackson impression. But really all that was was me grabbing my little baby crotch over and over again and then laying on the ground and doing that weird little humping move that he does on the floor. Yeah, it was awkward. But you know what the best part was is that my family was just really, really proud of me the whole time. Like my parents were so proud of me grabbing my baby crotch. What are your parents proud of you for? Oh man, I had nothing compares to that. Can you do a little Michael Jackson impression for me? <laughs> oh my God. Wow, okay, that was great. It's really good, it's really good at that. When I was in sixth grade, I auditioned for my church's production of The Music Man. I auditioned for the role of Winthrop, who's meant to be played by a five to eight year old. I was about 11. I did not get the role, but I did get the role of boy in the library number three. And let me tell you, I could step ball change like a motherfucker. I'm so proud of you, Rob. Thank you, thank you. I'm Have so you ever proud of been you. in The Music Man? No. It's a pretty good musical. You could check it out. I would. For boy number three in the library. Yeah. yeah. You won't see my production. It was in 1994 and never captured on any media, ever. How about you? Have you ever been in The Music Man? Um, somewhat. We did some songs, and I got to be Miriam, and we actually never put it on, so. <laughs> Didn't have a show. What about Shapoopy? You know about Shapoopy? know about Shapoopy. I was the only kid that could dance the Shapoopy, though. <laughs> we should bring back the Shapoopy. <laughs> Shapoopy. Shapoopy. Last summer, I signed up for a dancing class that Bella Thorne was teaching just because I really wanted to be near Bella Thorne. And I arrived and I was like 45 years older than everyone in the class. And all these little kids were like really good dancers. And Bella Thorne was going around the class helping everybody, just making tiny adjustments. And every time she got near me, I'd geek out and like literally hyperventilate. And she was so nice about it and she was like, it's okay, are you okay? everything's going to be fine. And I was like, you don't understand how exciting this is for me. And she was like, okay, just try to keep moving your body and dance. Hey, do you like to dance? Oh, love to dance. Disco dancing. Oh, really? Did, are you signing up for yeah. disco dancing classes? <laughs> Saturday Night Fever. That was are you era. John Travolta? No, that was my era. Are, are you sure you're not John Travolta? Oh, no. I wish I was, though. No. Maybe you're a retired John Travolta. Oh, well, I like to fly his plane. Oh, yeah, he got a good plane. Do you want to show us a little disco dance right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, show us your dance. Show us a little disco dance. Oh, you, it's all you, baby? Yeah, to the cam, for the cam. The, turn around. Is this your time to shine? Do that little disco dance. Do 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 oh okay oh do 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 Hey we did it we disco danced 
<laughs> wow, that was great. Are you super inspired by that? I am. Are you going to sign up for John Travolta's class? I absolutely. This is John Travolta. I'm a little starstruck. I know. Me too. Wow. I can't believe we just met John Travolta. When I was in high school, I tried to start a band that would only cover Electric Mayhem from the Muppets songs. We only had a drummer and a bass player and never played a show and never learned the songs. So I guess we failed at that on every level. But it doesn't change my dreams of wanting to actually be a Muppet. Do you have a dream? What's, what's your dream? Um, I don't know. I, I don't know. You kind of caught me off guard, man. <laughs> I know. That's kind of the point. What, what's, what would be, do you have a Muppet that you would want to be if you were a Muppet? Um, I like Kermit. He's pretty popular now, you know, with the tea memes and all of that. So. <laughs> I like him. He's funny. <laughs> Kermit really kills it. How about you? Do you have a favorite Muppet? It actually was Piggy. Now it's... Um, oh my gosh, I forgot his name. Sam the Eagle. No, definitely not him. <laughs> He's conservative. Fozzie, it's Fozzie now. Ah! <laughs> wow! Cool, that's cool. Mine's Animal. Yeah, Animal. When I was 10, I watched Priscilla, Queen of the Desert for the first time. And I became so obsessed because I'm a big ABBA fan and I love drag queens. But that movie also made me super, super depressed because 10-year-old me was like, I don't understand why I wasn't born a man so I could grow up and be a drag queen. And I was just devastated and I used to cry like twice a day about it. And then for my 11th birthday, my godmother was like, what do you want for your birthday? And I was like, can I be a man? And she was like, that's expensive. So she just bought me the soundtrack instead, which is actually still pretty good. Hey, man, do you have a soundtrack? Do I have a soundtrack? Do you own any soundtracks? Oh, yeah. Uh, you got some good soundtracks. I thought you were like, oh, yeah, you want to fucking talk soundtracks? What's your favorite one? I mean, Rent was on heavy rotation for a long time. I love Rent. That's it's such awesome. an uplifting musical. It's oh, so fun. This has been Couch, Couch Confessions. Confessions. Thank you wow. so much. That was so fun. Thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you. Wow. You know, I feel like we really connected with this audience, but now we got to go backstage. Oh, yeah. Because Jessica Keenan Wynn is there getting Ooh, ready. I hope she's back here. Yeah. Look at a peep. I want to peek. I want to yeah. see, see if she's ready for Bill. See if she's coming ready. Coming out to pick soon, I heard. Yeah, she might be coming soon. Uh, you know, uh, I haven't seen Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again yet. Oh, you haven't? No, but I just keep watching Mamma Mia over and over again because for <laughs> me, why not Here We Go Again on the again, original again. too, yeah. yeah. I but just I'm gonna catch keep it. on Here We Going Again, 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 and Again. Mm. Just real quick shout out to Brittany Jones Cooper. Oh, watch, oh, see her right yeah. there. Oh, hello, my favorite moderator. Hi. Hi. Are you excited for this bill? I'm very excited because I did see Mamma Mia, Here We Go Again, mm. and Jessica Keenan Wynn's portrayal of young Tanya is. Oh, magnificent. So good. Everyone is saying she stole the show, right? I think she did, guys. I think she did. But we're going to talk about it in oh. a little bit. Well, yeah. So is. stick there around. Oh, there she is, oh, there she is taking pics. Which means Woo! we're about to go up on Bill. Yeah, in no time. Yeah. So it's going to be exciting. Maybe Who knows what could happen? It might be a little sing moment. Yeah. Uh, maybe here in Brittany Jones Cooper would just do the entire, they'll just act out the entire film. You think they're just going to reenact the entire film I on Bill? I think so. Bill? I think so. I mean, look, they just had a great photo there. I feel like it could happen. Yeah. Well, it's all about the chemistry, and obviously it's happening. So. Yeah. Who doesn't have chemistry with yeah. Brittany Jones Cooper, though? No. She's a you star. Know? She's a star moderator. Well, this has been amazing. Thank you so much for hanging out with us on Build Up. Don't yeah. go anywhere, because Jessica Keena Win Keenan Wynn is up next on Build. Woo! Woo! Thank you.